Hello everyone. Today's unboxing for the April box. I hope everyone is staying healthy and uh, doing well and keeping indoors. Um, today I'm opening up the Crystal Council box um, for April. Um, I did open it but I didn't really unwrap anything so it was my first time actually opening it really. But when I did open it I got to see this card and this is the first thing that you see. So when you see this, you know that this is a group of people that really care for people and they really care for their products. That's their newsletter. We hope everyone is staying safe and healthy during this pandemic. It's unfortunate that this has happened, but it is now our job to overcome the current challenges we are facing. We, not, we may not be able to physically help others around us, but we can affect them spiritually. Blessing others with you and your crystals energies can help heal the world. Remember to keep your mental health in check during the time and know that it's okay not to be as productive as you normally are. Stay safe and take care of your loved ones. The Crystal Council. Zodiac Transitions, April 21st, Taurus. And Lunar Events, April 22nd, New Moon. So that's good to find out. There's a little dog that's cute. <clears throat> and grow sunflowers. Start of spring. So plant that out there. And this was actually drawn um, by someone for the Crystal Council. It's a sticker. Uh, it's really beautiful. It's quite, it shows some peace and strength. And I love it. And of course this is the scroll that they attach all the time. It's usually like really, really long. Uh, and my name for the group is Howling Mirage. This is a random one I picked, but um, yeah. <laughs> uh, but the beginning part, I'm not going to read the whole thing, um, but it's even though the world may be in a chaotic s state, it is important to only focus on what you can control. Take this time to reflect upon how you have reached to this uncertain time so far. A healthy body starts with a clear mind. So maximize, maximize this unique circumstance to look inward and grow. Know that something positive will come out of this. It, in darkness comes light. This month, we've craft, crafted your box around joy, transformation, anxiety relief, and meditation. And there's a list of uh, stones that are on here, which I will read them. Um, there's actually one I already see that I'm going to really love. <laughs> this is the free stone that they provided. Um, this is the ruby. Uh, that, uh, let me see here. Uh, ruby uh, Zestalite. <laughs> Horrible pronouncing these names. But I, I do have one of these, um, but this one actually shows more of the ruby, which is really nice to have. Um, it's a beautiful stone. Alright, so let's open one of these. This one isn't labeled. That's okay, because I've learned about that. You know, I can guess and find out if it's incorrect. Uh... It's shiny, I don't know if it's oiled or what, but I think that is green citrine, let me see. Oh, green calcite. <laughs> so it's a very calming and soothing stone that is great for meditation work. It will reduce daily stress, so it's perfect for what's happening these days. I like those lines here. I just noticed that. So it belonged to like a bigger stone here and it just is like a circle. It's kind of like the, the tree with their age marks. Kind of cool. This is Labyrinth. There's so many of these. So you can never have enough Labyrinth. It's a beautiful stone. There's so many colors. 
all about different colors and anything that sparkles or shines. <laughs> Thanks for me. There you go. See the palms down here. Ooh, that's really that's really nice. Look at that sheen right there. That's perfect. Oh, even on the other side, it kind of like follows with it. This is a really nice one. The sparkles inside there. So they did give me something sparkly, that's for sure. This is a really nice one. This is actually a lot nicer than the bigger palm stones I have. This could be a good um, thumb one. So you're there, anxiety's kicking in. Just keep rubbing and rubbing and rubbing. Look how, that's so nice. I like that one a lot. And um, elaborates a stone of magic and protection, allowing one to access the deep depths. So that's really nice. Good for transformation too. Banded agate. I don't know one of these. I was just looking at something about agate today, which is actually kind of, I was looking at a YouTube video. Oh, look at, look at that. That's so cool. It's a cross. That's pretty cool. But the pattern of that is just outstanding. I'm just going to take a picture real quick. It's very nice. An agate, also known as banded agate, is the rarest and highest vibrational stone out of all the agates. This stone is found in a very closed off dis a district in Botswana, and it's hard to acquire in large quantities. Um, while meditating with the stone, one will notice a gentle push forward uh, push forward towards their life path as on, as almost as if it is a helping hand. Allow the stone to jumpstart you on a new fresh path with endless opportunities. So it's, how, it's a good guiding stone, so I like that a lot. I wonder if that's a sign. <laughs> uh, oh boy. Uh, Desert Rose Selenite. I have one of these. Again, you can never have enough. They're always, always different, too. It says all the elements when sand, water, water gets, uh, or the sand gets trapped within the water and dries up, I guess, with the air, and it creates this. So all the almonds in one, which is kind of cool. So that's what I got today. Um, other than, I mean, the sticker and everything is great. Um, sunflowers, you know, awesome. Um, I'm really happy about the two stones here. Um, but like I said, I already have both of these. We can, like, this one is a lot bigger than the one I have. Um, I already have this. So, from a scale of 1 to 10, I, I give this, like, a, probably, like, a 5. Um, last month was a lot better. But, um, I know there's a lot of things going on, you know, in the world. So, I don't know if that's part of it or what. But, um, you know, I continue with this description. Uh, I support these guys 100 so um but that's it and hope everyone stays safe and have a great great day